Hello everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm Karen and this is a DIY channel with a lot of thrift flips and fun creative projects. So if you like this, it would be really nice if you subscribe or if you like this video, give it a like or a comment. Uh, I would really appreciate this. So today I'm standing again in my mobile home and I made a little fun project that gives a bit of color to this uh, room, to this mobile home and a little bit of joy. So I take you with me uh, in this journey. It's, um, in fact, it's not a part of the mobile home renovation because it's just such a little uh, th uh, project I did, but it makes a huge difference in the room. So uh, in fact, it's paint with me video. Uh, I show you around how I painted an uh, accent wall and how, um, yeah, I made my decisions in how to do that and um, the fun thing is I used chalk paint from Annie Sloan. I'm really a fan of her. She is such a creative person which <laughs> uh, and is so bold in her choices and how she makes things. So she inspired me to do a bold uh, mural painting in the mobile home and uh, I take you with, with me in that process. Have fun! Let me know what you think about it at the end. Thank you, bye-bye. So the project I'm working on is this little wall at the entrance of our mobile home and uh, this is the side wall of the kitchen. I want to make a painting of stripes. I'm inspired by this color palette from Annie Sloan. I think this is such a wonderful color palette. I don't have the same colors uh, at the moment but I made some uh, samples to look what would be a nice color combination and I just hang them up here to look which one we prefer so I'm gonna discuss it with my husband <laughs> So, a 
as you see, the colors are not um, covering in one layer, so I have to go over it again. And that's okay, like this I did two layers and it's about to be good. This one needs another one, but that covers badly. The Apuson Blue needs another one. The Graphite Grey needs another one. So I will do that later when it's dry. You see the difference between the waxed colors and the not waxed colors. So I'm wondering if the, when it dries, it's getting a bit less shiny, but uh, the color are more vibrant with the wax. So now it's finished and I'm really happy with this colorful entrance of our mobile home. It's a bit a small space, so it's quite difficult to film, I must say. Um, so here you come inside, and the first thing you see is the wall painting with all kinds of happy colors.